Okay, so I was debating on whether I should video this or not, but um, you know what? I'm gonna shoot my shot. Here we go. <laughs> All right. So um, got my little setup going on back there. My hose, hose is on. You do have to turn it on, the valve on every time you uh, you go. Um, and cloth wipes and a little spritzer should you know you need a little extra cleaning I just use my old essential oil baby wipe recipe and um, now that I'm thinking about it I think I'm gonna turn the pressure down a little bit <laughs> for this for this first go because I mean I don't need the pressure or it's just a test run so okay um, now, one of the things that makes the sprayer a little more challenging than the, you know, just seated bidet, other than the fact that there's not a heating option on it, is that you have to, like, hand spray. So there's going to be a little angling issue, and, um, I don't know, splashback maybe? I'm not really sure. I'm a little nervous. Uh, so the suggestion is that you start at, like, a, a high angle and then round towards the front, you know, as you're kind of making your way through your business. Um, I'm not going the full nine this time. This is more just gonna be a, just a little, how's it going? All right. <laughs> Instant regret. <laughs> So it's refreshing. It's cold. Uh, but I was worried about it coming out through the front and it hasn't, so that's a good thing. Um, mid pressure is adequate for, I would imagine, most situations. Um, but it's nice to know that there's a little more, a little oomph there should you need it. Um, it'll take your breath away, so just be ready for that. Uh, if you have any serious heart conditions, you might want to consult your physician prior to going with a full cold bidet. Uh, so we'll see how my husband likes it. <laughs> and if it's something sustainable for him or my four-year-old toddler, now that I think about it. Okay, this is going to be interesting. Keep you updated. Bye.